The sweet sound of a young voice praising the name of the Almighty God. Fourteen-year-old Brenda Azizuyo stands miles away from home on this waterfront. This is Bethany Children's Village, Nabitaka camping site, where Brenda, along with 85 other children, has come to spend time together in fellowship and prayer. This journey has been made possible by World Vision Uganda, a Christian, child-focused, relief, development and advocacy non-governmental organization working with communities and other stakeholders to improve lives of the poor and suffering people. Each one of these children has a different story to tell of how they have come to be together for the World Vision National Children's Bible Camp. Savior, I come, quiet my soul. Remember, redemption's here, where your blood was spilled for my ransom. Everything I once had. We join the children on this journey as they set off from Gaba Community Church on a boat ride to Nabitaka landing site. children the word of God. If they can really grow in the fear of God, they can grow in the knowledge of God, I believe uh, they will live a better life uh, and their life will be very different from those ones who really don't know God. Because uh, even the Bible says that train your child in the ways of God while he's still young, then he will grow a better passion. To help get the children involved in prayer, for the designated five days at the camp, World Vision enlisted the help of Christian Evangelism Fellowship, CEF, to facilitate the program and disciple the children. To begin with, we, we plan and we, may, we come up with a program for five days. We have young people who are still in schools. We train these young people, the counselors, to know how to handle them and to be careful as they handle them. To, we have a policy called no physical contact. So we, t 
tell them to have a distance, a minimum distance, as they interact with these children, uh, not to be misunderstood. With a team of 10, CEF took on the task of implementing the plan. The 86 children were divided into 10 groups, each given a name and a counsellor. We were considered the classes, those ones in secondary, we separated them, it was a group of his own, and then we went down to classes 7, 6, 5, and then downwards. It is to tame discipline to bring about this one, because if you are identified as faith, you will be belonging to that group, faith, be it quiet time, sleeping, you belong to that group. As, because as we come as a huge group, we don't know each other. So we are identified by groups. It's about identifying ourselves. In that way, it calls us to compose a slogan. And our slogan for faith is faith, faith, faith. Faith is just believing what God says he will do. Faith, faith, faith each child will be touched by the message each group will present. So there is a teaching in each and every group. Every day, for the duration of the camp, the children, along with their counsellor, followed the plan drawn up by CEF. The day started off with morning devotions and quiet time. You can do nothing without me. So it is God the Holy Spirit who is enabling us to do wonderful 